Developing tonight, Georgia Congresswoman Marjorie Taylor Greene sponsoring the Fire Fauci Act aimed at getting Dr. Anthony Fauci, one of the country's leading public health experts, removed from his job. The bill has gained support from other Republicans who say trust in Fauci has been shattered. And the American people deserve the answers and count accountability should be held for Dr. Fauci and all of those involved. Marjorie Taylor Greene once again commanding the spotlight this time to call for the firing of Dr. Anthony Fauci. Dr. Fauci was not elected by the American people. He was not chosen to guide our economy. He was not chosen to rule over parents and their children's education. But yet Dr. Fauci very much controlled our lives for the past year. Critics pointed Fauci's inconsistent messages on masks, as well as renewed questions about the origins of COVID-19 and whether U.S. government grants helped fund research at a Chinese lab in Wuhan, China, that many believe played a role in the virus's initial spread. Emory Dr. Carlos Del Rio says Dr. Fauci doesn't need to be fired. He needs to be celebrated for his service to the country. You have to find a person to blame for, for the multiple errors that happened in the management of the pandemic in our country. And instead of blaming uh, President Trump and his uh, very, uh, uh, really, you know, bad management of the pandemic, when in multiple situations he said, this is gonna go, go away, we don't need to worry, and multiple other things, you know, instead of blaming him, they wanna blame somebody else. And Fauci seems like the appropriate person to blame. The White House has said President Biden has no plans to fire Dr. Fauci, who has served for decades under Democrats and Republicans. Congresswoman Green's bill has virtually no chance of passing, given the Democrats hold majorities in both the House and Senate.